out here is we've got a Suter built 6000 series. It's a pretty old blower. Um, it's kind of obsolete, but there are still a lot of them out in operation. This is one of two at a plant in Ohio. This blower uh, had kind of an unusual failure. The oil cooler had a rupture and it filled the whole blower with water. The water set inside the blower and caused a lot of rust and it also failed the bearings. So what we had to do is we had to remove the blower from the warehouse that it was at. We had to bring the blower back here. We had to disassemble it, do a thorough cleaning, replace all of the parts that were bad, and now we're getting ready to test it. What we're doing here for our test is we've got a VFD, which is a variable frequency drive. We can spin this drive at any speed we want to. Um, we are going to be turning this blower at about 750 RPMs. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to run it for about an hour. We're going to make sure that it's got good oil pressure and that we don't have any problems. We'll know that we've got everything right when we've got good oil pressure. This is a four-speed lubrication blower, which is kind of unusual. Most blowers are a splash lubricated or a grease lubricated. Um, this blower actually has an oil pump and it pumps oil throughout the system and lubricates the bearings. So one of the first things that we're going to look at when we run it is to make sure that we've got a good oil pressure. We're going to make sure that we've got good smooth operation and that it's moving plenty of air. Um, this big blower is a 22 inch blower which is about the biggest one out there and uh, it moves a lot of air. It was great uh, working with uh, Brian, Jim. Uh, Jim came over, took the blower out for us. Uh, he's going to be doing the installation, did a complete rebuild, uh, communicated throughout the whole process. Actually invited me back for a test run of the blower. Witnessed that today. Everything's going great. It's been a real pleasure. Great communication. Always kept me informed of what was going on. and. Uh, Looks like this is going to be a really good project for the, for the plant.